It's fun to geek out on gadgets and cool new technology, right? Well, my job is to not only show you what cool things you can play with, but also how technology can enhance your life in dramatic ways. Like, how about ways to keep your kids safe and at arm's reach, even if they aren't? I'm Callie Lewis. Welcome to Geek Beats. This episode of Geek TV is brought to you by Netflix. Keeping your kids safe and knowing where they are is possible like never before thanks to technology. Now, this is a big subject, so I'm going to focus on gadgets and apps today and leave the topic of teaching them to be safe while on the internet for another time because it's a whole other story. <laughs> Let's start with basic safety alert gadgets. OnGuard is a digital watch that serves all the purposes of a normal watch, like telling time, but adds safety features. If your kid is approached by a stranger and they feel in danger, in addition to teaching them to say no and walk away or to scream, why not teach them to use the 110 decibel emergency alarm on the watch? Also great for if they get separated from you at the mall or in any kind of danger or just plain feel uncomfortable. There's also a high intensity SOS light and a child ID label on the back. It's 25 bucks. For $240, the Ion Kids Child Monitor uses RF to tell you if your kid has wandered too far from you, especially good for small children or hey, even pets or parents with health issues. You put the wristband on the kid and you hold onto the base, which is about six inches long like a TV remote. When they're too far away from the base unit, the alarm will sound on both devices. Use the base to detect where the child is. It's also great for public places like the mall. The kid's smart vocal smoke detector is pretty darn cool. When it detects smoke, it'll guide your kid on the correct procedure to safety. But what's so neat about it is that it's your voice, which they're more likely to listen to in an emergency, right? You pre-record stuff like, hey, Robbie, wake up. And then you follow it up with instructions on what to do. That combined with the practice of an emergency exit plan, hopefully they'll panic less and get to safety quicker. And $50 isn't bad for peace of mind. For pool safety, you could always get a pool alarm, but be sure to find one that doesn't require the kid to be wearing a bracelet. That won't help if they just wander into the backyard and plop into the pool. I had a hard time finding a pool alarm that I could feel comfortable recommending, to be honest. So if you have one or have experience with them, please leave a comment below and we'll update our show notes at geeky.tv 678. Now, if your family has made the decision that you're comfortable using GPS to track your kid, there are quite a lot of options these days. For goodness sakes, some public schools are even starting to use GPS to track kids on school buses to make sure they got on the right bus and got to school. The Amber Alert GPS tracker tracks your kids' movements throughout the day so you know where they are at all times. It has an SOS button if the kid feels like they're in trouble and you'll get an email or text message. I don't know why you'd opt for email. I'd prefer SMS for faster delivery. It has two-way voice so that you can talk to your kid at any time. And if they leave a pre-designated area, like the route to and from school, you'll be alerted. It's also synced with the National Sex Offender Registry and will tell you if your kid goes within 500 feet of a registered sex offender's house. For older kids, there's a speed alert so you can yell at them for driving too fast if you want. <laughs> it's $220 with a free year of service. Pocket Finder does a lot of the same stuff, not everything, for $150. It's a tag essentially that you can put in your kid's backpack or in their pocket or wherever. Life360 is just an app, no physical device required. I've used this before and it's pretty scary in terms of the amount of data it provides, but you'll love it for keeping track of your kids. The app runs in the background and logs where your kid is at all times. You can even pull up a map of their day. It'll tell you where registered sex offenders are located and... If you're having trouble with your kid or teen feeling like you want to track them via GPS because you don't trust them, well, this is a great rebuttal because it's tracking for the whole family. They can see where you are too, if you want, and you can use it as a family messaging app. Keep each other up to date on when you'll be home or if they're going to go to a study group, all within the app itself. It's a free app and works on iOS, Android, and BlackBerry. 
If tracking is less your issue and you want to be able to see your kid at home while you're away, set up a private drop cam. We use them here at the Geek Beat Studios, so you can check it out to see it in action first, geekbeat.tv slash drop cam. It serves as a great nanny cam, and it's even a great way for traveling parents to stay up to date with how things are going on in the house. Hopefully keeping a closer eye on the kid and teaching them the right ways to live will keep them out of trouble and out of prison. Speaking of prison, have you seen the new series on Netflix, Orange is the New Black? All right, because of the guys in the chat room, I watched the first episode not knowing exactly what to expect. It's pretty good. What's your favorite show on Netflix? Give me some suggestions. And if you haven't signed up yet, it's definitely worth it. Just go to netflix.com slash geekbeat for your free 30-day trial and to support this show. Also, let me know how you keep your kids safe. Twitter, Google+, the Geeks community, our live chat room, your choice. I just look forward to hearing from you. I'm Callie Lewis. Bye-bye, guys. What are we redoing that part? That... God. Stop. Why is this thing so delayed? Oh, it's just you. It doesn't give anybody else any problems.